Stop being such a girl. Those look good too. You're not the one needing to meet a guy tonight. And you don't need to meet a guy at a bar either. Stop it already. I'm not doing that stupid internet dating crap. Yeah, now that college is over, you have to meet a guy at a bar. It's more normal than using the internet. That might work for me. Oh, hey, he's cute. And he works for a Lexus dealership. Wait, works for you? How many creepy losers that live in their profiles did you have to meet before Jeremy? Technically, they were my brother, but it's okay. We look a lot alike. I got this awesome job offer, and I... What was that? What was what? And after a few years, I just never bothered updating the picture. But if she found my profile, that would mean she's cheating on me. And that would never happen. She's a married woman. You just took a picture. No, I didn't. Oh, baby, don't worry. I ain't gonna turn you in. Oh, that picture was pre-op. Besides, 17's the new 30. I could hear it. It was my ringtone. It's not like girls are that concerned about looks anyway, like guys are. Is this a spy cam? No. Our food coming anytime soon? My wife's got me on a diet and I am always starving. I thought you might want to reconsider. Don't be afraid to try something new. Hmm. Expected your boots to be bigger. Still got the right parts in the right places. You're not seeing this? I'll have a couple more apple teas. See what happens. This is my spare. At least I've been late in the last six months. What? Yeah, then I told her I already put my number. Told her I already put my number in her phone. God bless her, that day. None of them ever check their phones. I'm sure they do, unless they find it. Okay, that's pretty clever. Yeah, it's still a douche though. Look, they got two options. One, they can sleep alone and never see me again. Or two, they can not sleep alone and never see me again. They probably do, trust me. They should consider themselves lucky they got one night. Dude, come on. Let's go over there. She just got here. Well, what about that girl that just walked by? Dude, she was hot. She probably got self-esteem. Let's go. After a couple years in the minors, you know, I loved it, and I was ready to go to the big, but I really want to get into pediatrics. I, I really love to help people, and during undergrad, I did this internship at a children's hospital, and those kids are amazing. That's incredible. I know. Whoa. Did our friends leave us? Oh my god, I didn't even notice her leaving. Huh. Was she a ride? My, my Lexus is right outside. I mean, I can, uh... I'll give you a ride. Yeah, it's not far. <laughs> yeah, it's no problem. Okay. okay. Yeah, but if it has a pulse, I want to help it. <laughs> That's so cute. Well, thank you for taking me all the way out. You didn't have to do that. No, of course, no problem. So be careful on your way home. Okay, I'm just I'm gonna go for it. Great time. I'm glad we ran into each other. You're not going to try to come in? We'll see each other again soon, right? What's in the middle for, too? Just come on in. <laughs> hey. Hey, I'm sorry. I should have been more careful. I didn't mean to wake you. No, it's okay. Are you leaving? Yeah, I got a huge test tomorrow. I'll be in the library all day studying. Well, good luck. Thanks. Hey, did I get your number? I think I'd let you get rid of me without it. Put it in your phone the second I woke up. You just have to remember my name. He sure got out of here fast. He looks familiar. He had to leave early because he'll be studying all day for his med school exam. I didn't think there was a med school around here. Just like you thought I couldn't meet a great guy at a bar? I didn't say it was impossible. Just a lot less likely. Less likely? <laughs> great guys don't need to resort to the internet to meet girls. That's why I said Jeremy was such a fluke. Yeah, that's a good point. Hey, have you seen my phone anywhere? <laughs>